Hi, happy Monday night to everyone. Welcome to day five of 10 days of gratitude. So each day for the past couple days, I've been posting a prompt to guide us in the different areas in our life that we can be thankful for. Um, because if you're anything like me, or actually my kids, I'll say, okay, if they're having a hard time falling asleep, I'll say, okay, um, instead of all the worries going through your head, start to thank the Lord for all the things that you have. And they'll look at me well, like, what? And I'll say, well, start at your head and work all the way down to your feet. And then, and then they go, well, what if I can't sleep after that? I'll say, well, then look around the room and start giving thanks for those things. So sometimes we don't even know what we have in our life to be thankful for until somebody kind of points it out. So that's kind of my goal with these 10 days of gratitude is just to get different days to think of all the things that we can be thankful for. Um, I've made a free journal that you can um, download and print out and write out your thankfulness. I'll put the link in the comments today again um, and you can grab that and fill it in as you please follow along or even just add in the comments or just on your own with your own paper and pen. Um, write down the things with gratitude. Anyways, so today is thankful for um, a friend that's been meaningful in your life right now. Um, and for me, um, so we've been living in Edmonton for eight and a half years and my family doesn't live here. So Greg's family does, but mine doesn't. Um, and what I've come to realize is when you live in a city without family, um, you start making your own family. Friends kind of become family, the kind of family. <laughs> um, and so those are the friends that I'm thankful for is those people, families, individuals, or yeah, individuals or families in our life that are like, like family. We can call, we know that they're going to be there for us if we need them. Um, they can call us, we, we're, we're going to be there if they need us. Um, people every day that are just helping you parent or just supporting you in different ways. And those are the relationships that I really cherish and I'm just so thankful for. So, um, yeah, cause friendship is something that I'm not really great at. <laughs> um, I'm not the best communicator, you know, sometimes days will go by and I'm like, right. Oh my goodness. I've been thinking about this person. I need to contact them. And then I forget. And so, um, these are also people that have helped me understand what friendship really means. And actually Greg's been really good at teaching me, showing me what friendship means and love in action. He's a very, um, his love language is acts of service. And so he loves just to go out and help people and we'll drop things, um, for friends and we'll do things. And that's, something that I've never really been great at. And so these are all things that I'm kind of learning through him and through our friends. And that's really awesome. So, um, in the comments below or on the thread before, just, um, yeah, think about a friend that you're just really thankful for. And if you want to share their name and tag them so you can see how grateful you are for them, then that would be awesome. Okay. Have a good evening and I'll see you back here live tomorrow.